Hello boys, welcome to an open array cast with me ZX Scannon in Red Alert 1. As you can see, the black high as Germany versus Unano as the dark red Ukraine. Yeah, how it comes that I'm also down to casting a game in RA because I really wanted to actually do something like this like in the like in the past but I didn't really got to. I was streaming the whole time and I've had more enjoyment than that, but now I really also want to get into casting, you know. And well, here we go. Here, or here we are at least. Like this is not a replay, this is a live game I'm casting right now. So else Yo. here we go. Oh, hey Doomsday by the way. You came too late, man. I'm currently casting a game between High and Unano. Oh well. Well, by the way, U Doomsday joined me also, boys, but he cannot see what I'm seeing, so he's just only a nice playthrough. <laughs> you can still say hello. <laughs> so imagine, boys, I'm I'm having a co-caster, but who cannot cast with me. Well, but maybe we can have some nice conversations, you know. So, well, anyway. Yeah, as you can see, Onano is opening with a nice little infantry opener. He, ha he produced over... 15 riflemen, I guess. So I assume he's going for double refinery opening. Why high went for like less riflemen? He's really going for. I think he he currently has only he produced only around seven at maximum ten riflemen. So maybe to get out some basic scouting. Maybe he wants to go for a war factory instead of double refinery. Let's see. No, oh, it's a it's a second refinery. Okay. Ah, but he goes for early medics, that's why. Okay, interesting. Interesting choice. Unano also went for double refinery. Hmm. Who knows? By the way, the next games you will see, guys, Doomsday will also join me with the casting. It's not like that we already tried to cra cast some replays, you know, or games. <laughs> this is the first one of the day we're, we're trying right now. <laughs> No, but seriously, we tried to replace before, but either w the game was either um, not finished because someone crashed or left in between, or the game was laggy, or I I forgot to switch the scene, which mean which meant to not having anything recorded at all. <laughs> oh well, hiccups can happen, you know. This this just the normal type of doings when you're trying to do something right, you know. Well, anyway, going back to the action. Oh, the game seems to be a little bit laggy. Well, not a little bit laggy, but l having a little bit performance issues. Interesting. Oh well. Can't have everything, right boys? Hmm. So as we can see so far, it's just a normal base opener as usual. While High went already for Quadra Barracks instead of a War Factory, while Unano is following the normal passive game. By the way, which map are we casting on by the way? It's it's Hesperian Hesperian Grove. Gr yeah, Grove. Must be Grove. Grove would be of double O, right? Yeah, Hesperian Hesperian something. Doesn't matter. Like it's an interesting new map I've um I've been playing like three weeks ago or so. I forgot who made this map, but I actually like this map. It's pretty cool man. Even if you would think like rush this like the rush distance is so fuck so small that you can easily go for like instant all ins or something, but because of the wood like the the forest in the middle is very hard to like push forward. Also slows down your movement. Oh, here we go with some, some minor engagements from high. He's really going through. Yeah, his army is currently bigger than that from Unano, so Unano needs to be careful so he's not losing too much to high's attacks. Little skirmish. Okay, Hai now also followed up with his war factory finally. While Unano is already in the lead of harvesters. Even though it's only one harvester more, that means that he has more income than Hai, which as you can see here, he has around like 300 more earned per minute than Hai does. But in the meantime, Hai is winning the main engagements because of his interesting quadra barracks at the beginning. Oh, and he's also following up with a ranger, so that means he has scouting vision to cover his ground. Okay. Hmm. Okay, he's trying to go for a scout. Uh, he found he found a rifleman and, and the rocket soldiers. Okay, he's really going for the scout right now. He could have easily sniped those rain until those rocket soldiers would go out. Oh well. Or maybe he's trying to kill them with his main ar the main army with his little 
squad of infantry there. Ah, and there we go. In the meantime, he's scouting with his ranger to see what Onano currently really does. Oh, Onano produced his first MCV. Oh yeah, there we go. So, two MCVs already out for Unano. Interesting. By the way, the game has a little bit performance issues for some reason. I don't know why. Could be because of the server. Oh well. Doesn't concern us right now. It's still, it's still easy to cast right now. Okay, anyway. Moving on to the game. Ah, he's really going for the soldiers of, of Unano. He's trying to get money and... Oh, oh! He found the service depot, trying to kill it, but there we go with the flame tower. So High has to move back a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, there comes an ore truck from Unano. I feel like he's trying to distract the fire of the arm, little army squad of High, so he can kill it with his main army. Interesting. Interesting strategy by Unano. Okay. It's, is there something else happening right now? Yeah, it's just a usual game. Like, since this ba since this map offers like two rather big fields, or they're actually they're kind of huge fields at the beginning for both players with five. Is it five? Four? The field? Yeah, with four ore mines. So they have quite sufficient eco at the beginning, so they can really go all out on their one base, go going from huge mid-game strategies with a lot of barracks and war factories or going for quick fast hacking. Since this is not a map from Soulscale, which means like Soulscale's new um, experimental balance changes, means it's just a normal... It could be seen as a Rago match, you know, like the, the people are familiar. So like that's just a, like the normal game of the normal balance um, issues. Issues. With the normal con... with the normal rules everyone is familiar with so anyway engagement from high on unano's forward outpost there quickly go getting rid of the flame tower and going through now yep. unano's having enough and trying to run away with mcv mcv run away ah in the meantime the, the main army of unano is moving south to defend his outpost oh well at least what's left what's left of that. Huh? Oh, oh that must have been a miss micro from Renano. He's moving his MCV in again. Ah, but the rocket soldiers haven't got track on it. Okay, interesting. Of high I mean. Okay, another flame tower plops out. Ah, get rid of it. Yeah, nice. Okay, he didn't lose that much units. Okay. In the meantime Renano coming from the top. Pushing through. Why the MCV of Onano is has been hunted down by High's rocket surges again. Oh, pillbox coming up. The mighty pillbox. The super saiyan, the super saiyan defense man. I would like to have the pillbox. As a Soviet, has such a good defense. Yeah. Anyway, High sacrificing some rocket soldiers to the go to the blood god. To a nano. Hmm. Okay, well. Fight has been settled. A nano has been dri driven out of the space. And High is keeping it now. So a nano finds him another base, maybe. Himself another base to harvest from. Maybe. Oh, he doesn't want to. Maybe goes around and goes for another base push from the self. Well, we're gonna see. Anyway. Ah, third MCV up for High. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, already a helipad, so Heinz coming in soon. On which tech level is Unano, by the way? Oh, he's still on tier 1.5. Heavy tanks. Heavy tank level. No radar dome, nothing. Oh, and his MCV is running into a standing army of High. Oh, God, this is devastating. Ah, oh, disaster. Oh, this is not looking good for Unano right now. That was, by the way, his... Yeah, that was his only MCV. Except this one is still in the main base. So he cannot expand right now. High is... Oh. Oh. A Chinook. Nothing in it yet. And two spies coming up. Oh. 
Wow. Mm -hmm. Hi is doing some of his shenanigans again. Well, is he Britain? No, he's Germany. So, I feel like, first of all, what you really want to do with the spy is really getting into a barracks so that all your infantry is getting veterancy. I mean, st also stealing money from refinery or powering down your opponent is also pretty nice to have, but if you get out a veterancy for your units, that's a huge thing. Oh, artillery shot from, from Una uh, against Unano's main army. Uh, hi is oh, hi, what you doing? Hi, what you doing? Oh, artillery sacrifice to the blood god. Okay, anyway. This Shinnok looks a bit weird. Yeah, I think he's infiltrating the barracks. Huh? Or oh, is he though? Oh, he's infiltrating the en energy. Oh, interesting. Interesting. I thought he would go for uh, for the ba for the veterancy. Oh well. In the meantime, game is having huge performance issues for some reason. <laughs> and Unano is going again is on going against the outpost of High here with the like his his air fleet production. Okay, <clears throat> moving on. I'm sorry that I didn't say anything, but it w there was not really something to talk about at this point. Okay, anyway, hi, hi is really going into the field on the field right now. Really going onto uh, on another space. Killed his ore trucks and the refinery, I guess. Oh, and the crush of the Chinook into Unano's army. Oh, that hurt. Oh well, <laughs> and the spectators going crazy. Okay, high stop MCV is moving down. Ah, yeah, where, is it, where will it go? I think it will. Maybe it will position itself here to get out, get out some nice turrets against the harvesters of Onano to really cut off his his whole harvesting. I mean, he first of all cut his harvesting from the south. Now he's going to kill that one from the north. Oh, that's interesting. He's breaking. He's breaking. High is breaking Unano down one bit, one bit by one bit, tearing him apart. Nope. Oh. Also, a nice engagement by both here. Hmm. But it looks like that Unano should win this one at least. But it's not looking good for Anando to be honest. Like he is down to one MCV, while High has three. High has already a nice forward outpost on the top. Still kept his both helipads and has gotten the hands on the bottom one. While Onano is still stuck in his main base, already lost his south expansion. Though actually his south control of the fields, that's also not good for Onano, and he's not g getting it back. So he has major flaw in income, as we will see here. Yeah. High said with 1,100 earns per minute. Oh, oh, that's not looking good. Udano now really needs a nice strike, a lucky strike on, on High's base or High's army. Or he might lose the game already. Oh, MCV of High parking here. Yeah, he's going for the tower pushing on the bottom now to to absolutely deny the eco ah oh, and from the oh he's doing it from both sides oh that's nasty for Unano Unano is in the meantime going for a main base push against high space but I feel like he won't accomplish anything with that hmm oh 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 high coming Pushing down from the north, soon pushing from the side, Heinz from the south, army from the west. Oh, this is not looking good for him. Oh, why well, actually, high uh, Unano has destroyed some uh, the power plant and yeah, it's only he only destroyed a power plant of high here. He's not moving forward. He should really go through and at least kill that stuff over here. Oh, now Unano is going for a base push here. Let's see if he has success with that. In the meantime, Unano losing his service depot. 
And the Heinz making quick dispose of this infantry blob. Oh, and killing the MC. Oh, killing the MCV of Unano there. Oh, oh, oh. Poor Unano, man. That's not his day. <laughs> He's already bidding his. Bidding, bidding high the Zedis to finally finish him off because Unano had enough. And I realize he can't win anymore. Oh well. Yeah, this is not looking good. He has to sell his airfield. He's now high level push through over here and make quick dispose of Unano's important structures. And, and Unano's already selling around everywhere. On oh, <laughs> interesting. He put <laughs> the radar dome into his opponent's base. Just don't need to mark him. Oh well. A Tesla coil. What a mighty defense. And there's the black Tesla coil. A Tesla coil with black color. It looks better than that one with the dark red. Well, anyway. Oh, flame tower still getting quick. Can still easily destroy the Tesla coil. It's after all, even though it packs a punch, it's still a relatively weak building. In HP wise, I mean. Cost 1200, 100 energy. Pack three, three times a Tesla coil punch. Ah. Such a good building, such a good defense. I love Soviets for having this wing. Such an iconic defense. Okay, anyway. Anan Unano is not giving up. He doesn't want to press the button. He wants to get finished right now. Oh well. Well, in the meantime, what does, did High write? Like, High really just went for an interesting bit at the beginning with Quadra Barracks to really suppress High's. Yeah, uh, highs I say. Unano's um, first attempts of getting the middle. Then high venti for the usual build, like going War Factory, getting out the of Harvesters, getting two additional MCVs. Then going for quick heliport actually, and going for some Shinnok Shin shenanigans with Spies, taking out the power of of Unano the whole time, while also stealing his money, I guess. Or did he steal? No, he didn't steal veterans. He just really went for the money. And, for and there is the GG called. GG by high. That was a nice game. 15,000 for high. Oh yeah, he really had the control over this game. Well, as we can see, as we've seen so far, boys, high is a very, very strong player, man. He did a little bit of cheesing, but this is his trademark. He doesn't like to play normal. He really, like G Dave always says, high just plays just to have fun, you know, testing out things, really just getting into the game and figuring out stuff, you know. This is our high. He's also Ty's also a very good TD player, by the way, from Tiberian Dawn. But he's also screwing out an RA and having fun here. So well, anyway, that was a nice game, and I hope I can just see you guys in the next video of mine, where I'm casting other games. Maybe next time with Doomsday. We will see. Well, anyway, see you next time, boys. Bye bye.